I will never get tired of hearing that um, I was people's first crush. <laughs> that it's is a nice thing. So flattering. I yeah, never give that. Very often. And you get it from guys very, and very, girls. Very, very often. Yes. Nice. I get it from guys and girls. Almost too. every. Yeah. It's almost nice. everyone who comments to me has that sweet You're thing. To everyone say. who's ever seen me just just says just like love. I just they love me. Yeah. And are obsessed with <laughs> yeah. me. And are attracted to me. No, I awaken guys. people's sexuality. Enough. <laughs> No, but it, I, I'm like, that is like a flattering thing that will flatter me for the rest of time. Like, that is like, that's, that's, that's cool. Mm -hmm. Yeah. To be on that list for people or whatever. Yeah. No, that actually is. Like, it's yeah. sweet. Even on TikTok, it happens now. Like, oh my God, you were my first crush. It's like, oh, 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 oh. little old me. <laughs> right? Okay. Tell me more. And then I we rewatched these episodes and I was like, she was cute. Okay. Hey. You were cute. I was crushing on you. Right? Yeah. <laughs> I had all those sweet little outfits going on, keeping everything covered. You know? Yeah, was Did that you guys thing? know that I had that issue? What is that it? You had too much boob for too middle school. Too much boob for, for middle school. Yeah, cause, so, because. Daniel and I were the age we were on the show every season. Like when we were, yeah. when Ned and Mose and Cookie were in sixth grade, Daniel and I were in sixth grade. Yeah. You were in, I think you were two grades older than us, even though only a year and four months. Yes. You were in eighth grade. Mm -hmm. So you were more mature than your character. I didn't remember they had to like hide your boobs. I guess oh, I do remember yeah, from, that. Okay. So I was like, wow, Mose really loved like one of our first fittings with Alicia. Mose really loves the, the, the layering and, and the hoodie. And she's like, I was like, what? <laughs> and she was like, you know, you're a little more developed. And so, and man, mm. they, they, I swear I have been fondled by, uh, oh, was like fondled the, by every, yeah, the costume. Uh, yes, people, costumer, because women they trying constantly to had to re-put the, the top stick like right, you know yeah, what I'm saying? Like yeah, cover. Most couldn't, and that's the thing we were talking about on other episodes is like, Ned's did have to be age appropriate. Right. It, it did have to be pure and innocent. Too many sweet yams. Too much sweet yams. You couldn't have those sweet yams showing. You know. Yeah. You and can it, have them. They just can't yeah. be showing that. It made me very like conscious of them in a negative way. Yeah. And so you didn't like the yams. You wanted fewer well, yams. Yams. Yams booty, right? Yams was yeah, something. Yams Let's talk sure. about well, what's our euphemism for boobies here. The yams would be the yams. What? I thought yams is, is booty. I think sweet Spend yams is all the way around. Oh yeah, yams is. A, I thought, be I thought I, yams was cheap. Yams is really the. Yeah, but, but just, you, it can be whatever what you want. What do we call? Yams. What do we call these? The um, ca cans. Cans. <laughs> Give me the cans. cans. Yeah, quick cans with a Z. <laughs> with a Z, turn up. <laughs> um, where were we? So it made you aware of <laughs> yeah. your cherries, a, your peaches, in a negative way, in a negative which is way. so funny because the next role that I played was this very like. A sex pot teenager on mm. Aliens in America. Mm. That's and right. where my stuff was like, you know what I mean? Like out, <laughs> out nice. and about. So they were trying to accentuate it in yes. that project. Yes. So you went from tucking it away, pure mm -hmm. innocent, yep. little baby child, yep. right to And I was like uncomfortable. Hollywood, I was like, oh, like they're looking. But And now that I look back, I wish I had just like enjoyed it more. Yeah. But of course <laughs> it's, it's not, it's hard. Of course, that's a real it unique a real... situation as a... Yeah, young person getting aware of your body, and then all of a sudden it's on camera, and adults are tucking yeah. it or accentuating it. Exactly, no, that's tucking weird. it. Yeah, that's tough. Yeah, that's weird. That's tucking it was tough. <laughs> no, no, I don't know. I'm I remember those days. <laughs> yeah, I remember having to take. Uh, did you ever have an erection and stand up in like class? Or anything? Does that ever happen? When a teacher's like, "Yo, you got to get up and present," and you're like, oh, <laughs> "No, nope. I don't want to get up." No, nope. happened to me all. Scott didn't give me a boner, man. <laughs> oh, Scott! Oh, you're talking about in school on set? No, yeah. Actual school, never. You never just when when you're like a kid, like first, yeah, when, when you're getting first... erections that you can't control. <laughs> and it's I, like, I wait, what? What happening. is happening? First of all, yeah, that, that happens. I, to I don't dudes. want people to know this. Yeah, yeah. Wait, for a while, for a while, you're Did getting. Did that happen to either of you? Not in, on I set. Ned's. No, I don't remember. It I don't has remember on set happened to me on set. Yes. Did it happen in Ned's? In Ned's, yeah, for sure. <laughs> That was the first time I was getting erections, you know? And then it's the first time I'm just around, like, females often. Yeah, right. For sure, right, for sure. Right, for sure. right, right. Oh, my God, I can't. I can't, I can't, I can't, I can't. I mean, Logan Browning played my girlfriend. Right? Set. Okay. So it was hard, you know, keeping myself composed. Dang. Yeah, yeah. yeah you were smitten, dude. I, yeah, you were smitten. I smitten. love smitten. Smitten. Logan, Logan Browning. Brown. Okay. She was beautiful. Yeah, but she was just such a great person. She really yeah, was. she is. She's a she chill was. person. Yeah. yeah. Chill yep. person. And also just, like, big, the beautiful cutest, green eyes. The like, cutest you know, thing you've ever you just so, lost, yeah. yeah dude her and she always gave me um 
another just great friend who's like a dog. Like I have to dap her up. She just so such a G. Tristan May. Yes, dude. Tristan is the shit. Yeah, she's she's gorgeous, but she's like the bro. Yo, man. I hadn't seen her since Ned's, and then I'm doing this movie uh in 2016, I think, uh called Where's the Money with uh King Batch mm -hmm, and mm -hmm. like Logan Paul and shit. And Batch is friends with Tristan. So mm. she came to visit him. And it was like, yo, lit. It was so good to see her. She is the homie. Yeah, and she was in love with you on the show, right? Or her character. Character was. Yeah. Her. She worked with me on Zeke and Luther once no too. No way. <laughs> yeah, I think she played Adam's like love interest. Or yeah, something she like that. played like some goth girl that was like obsessed with me and scary on Ned's like one episode. Yeah. But it was a trip to see each other as adults and be like, yo. What was the doing? line she had? Like some she called you mop hit. Yeah, something like no, mob head or something i got we we're not at that episode. we'll get to that, that i think that's like third season when she was on second or third i don't think it's oh. first so you had a crush on logan that's sweet oh yeah for sure she was awesome um teachers <laughs> uh oh yeah i had a crush on miss in style so cookie if, if you haven't seen that yeah, episode i mean basically the episode was you getting an erection yeah from miss <laughs> in style you know and i'm just drooling in this bucket now i remember i actually had a teacher uh i think this wasn't until second season but it was similar so Cookie was just infatuated with this woman, and he has a drool bug, and he's just, blah, 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 and that's why he's getting an F every um, every test he takes because he just cannot focus um, with her, and so he tries all these methods to not. Uh, what what was the tip you gave Cookie to avoid well, that? Well, we did different things. It was just like just focus on the work. Like basically, you failed at everything until the end of the episode, and then it was just like you got to transfer. You got to transfer. Like yeah. if you're distracted, just transfer out. Yeah. Um, you helped Mr. Dren get the responsibility and the respect of the class back. I like Ned's storyline in this. It was pretty funny. It's like he's trying all these things to get on Sweeney's good side to not fail. Oh, yeah. Uh, kissing his ass, you know, like dressing like him, all these things. And the end of the episode, it's like, Ned, have you ever just tried doing the work? Oh, yeah, yeah. That was and a I'm good like, one. Do the work. One. Yep. Do, do the work. work. Yeah. And it's just such a good, pure, real yeah. life tip is yeah. like, yeah, you can try all the tricks, but you could also just, just do it. Do it, yeah. Do the work, you won't fail. Um, you might not get an A, but you won't fail. This episode had another good line that I loved, and I think we would say it as an inside joke after this, was it was a Moe's line, I feel dirty just standing next to you. Because oh. I said, I'm gonna do something that's- Teacher's pet. I'm gonna do something that no one likes. Mm -hmm. I'm gonna become the teacher's pet. And it's like, oh! <gasps> No one likes the teacher's pet. I feel dirty just, just standing next I, to you. I look so, like I'm about to break on the last part of that, so I feel like that I was something it. funny that we could not like. Yeah, well, because this is where your comedy started to come out more. Like you're again, you're so good at just being that like real grounded kind of straight man character. But then when you need to, like, you hit that line. You were also like covered in shit at the point, yeah. but like, but you just hit that. I feel. You're just standing, standing next, next to you. you. Like, you hit it. Bruh. Yeah, it's funny. I shit. loved any time that, obviously, anything extracurricular was added to my face, spitball, like that pickle. Like, any time that oh, yeah. you got to, like, you know. Yeah. Be the, yeah. Be the mess. Yeah, be, be the, the mess. The kook. Mm -hmm. yep. Yeah. So that's really, funny, really man. fun. Um, but that's literally, there's another straightforward episode. Man. I think they're I all straightforward. Yeah, they're all, yeah, they're 11 minutes of um, action-packed middle school comedy. Right. Yeah. Back to your erections, Daniel. Um, yeah. My erections, yes. Straight up. Welcome yes. back to Ned's Declassified <laughs> Erection Survival Guide. Erection right, Survival right, Guide. Right Daniel yeah. Curtis right Lee. On. They're going to happen, all right? And you're not always going to survive that erection, okay? <laughs> wow. Um, it, have you guys ever just... Well, at school, you didn't really do the school thing, but did you? Yeah, no. I mean, I did. Were you school. ever in love with like a teacher? Like, by any nah, chance? Nah, I never had a I had a only this a cousin. Awesome teacher. <laughs> oh, well, well damn. Hold on. Hold on. <laughs> Hello, <laughs> Nebraska. Back no, track. but like, you know what I mean? It, were you guys never just like <laughs> attracted to my cousin? No, that's. No. No, we can't do that on this podcast. Wow. <laughs> we can't even bring it up. Not a try. Like, when I was, like, you had a little nine flirtation. years old, okay, I was, okay. like, there was a little flirt scene. You're cute. And, like, I'm your cousin. What does that mean? <laughs> it's like, you're the first boy I've ever met yeah, in my life. Like, it yeah, like. and you're cute. Mm. <laughs> <laughs> That's funny. That's funny. Kind of funny. Maybe It's kind so of funny. funny. Maybe it's yeah. not so funny. Absolutely not meant with I, anything <laughs> other than the innocent funny yeah, idea yeah, yeah, that yeah. that was. And no, there's a whole probably thing. No, there's a whole thing with with cousins um i watched a stand-up special from this this girl that my sister went to college with i think her name's delaney something she yeah. did this whole stand-up bit about i think that 
her parents are cousins or someone in her family is like a cousin couple adults on top of the stand-up bit she did this like youtube kind of like funny weird exploration of like cousins who have gotten together and maybe they're like more removed than like first cousins right they're like more down the line but apparently there are some cousins out there who are just together <laughs>